guys, welcome back to the videos from simplelifestories.net. My name is Munia and here is the next video from Simple Life Stories. And uh, in this video I'm going to show you how to include these little images in your planner. And that will be so easy, you can't believe it. And we all do that with this Polaroid mobile device. And um, yeah, let me show you how to do that. I have an iPhone, but of course you can use your Android phone as well. It doesn't really matter. All you need to do is you need to download the Polaroid uh, Zip app. And um, with that one, we can do all the magic. So let me first show you this mobile printer. So it comes for about $100, I guess, a little bit more, I think. Um, and it has uh, some special paper in it. And this special paper uh, will be developed once you uh, print it out. And uh, this happens with this pretty card here. It has a barcode. And um, for my phone, the photo will be sent to this camera, uh, to this mobile device, and then, um, push it onto the sheet of paper and as you can see these are pretty small but it will be much too big for our planner so we will use the app to put it into four and then put them on here so how cool is that that your life planner will not just your life planner anymore but also your scrapbook and all that in just a question of minutes so let me show you how you do that Let's get on the phone. So you see I've opened the app. And what I do now is I click on collage and then on gallery. And then I can choose from my photos. So let me show you from yesterday. Yesterday morning I went um, to the city close by and we had a blast to just chop for this stuff here. So let me show you. Then we had Leda a picture and did some crafting and my friend sent me a picture from her little girls. She just had a new baby. So all that I want to print out and put here into my plan. So I just choose a picture, type on it and you see this is what comes up and um, I can close that. But I need to tell it I want four pictures on one sheet. So the next thing is I want to turn it around and then I need to, it's a bit tricky, but you need to make that bigger. So you need to make sure that there is nothing white around here. You can of course change the picture, just get rid of it and click plus again. And then again, just type in, here's our dog and um, make it a bit bigger. That's it. You see I have some white edges, that's why I'm making it a bit bigger. So, choose more. Actually, you need to choose four pictures. Make sure that all is on what you want to. Get closer if you need to. And um, yeah, that is how it will work. Very easy. Yeah, that's when we have pizza. And one last thing, the door. I've got a new paint, so the garden looks much better now. Yeah, when you are done now, you click on the printer sign. And this is what will come up. You see, there are no white edges now. And um, that would be just fine. But when I click now on printer, it says no device selected. So how do I uh, connect them both? So pretty easy. Again, I go out of that and uh, go back into my settings. And then when I'm here, I go to Bluetooth and say, okay, uh, connect, Polaroid connect. And it might take a few seconds. And what you need to do, you need to push the button here. And uh, maybe it won't find it right now because um, I first need to push it and then print it. It worked actually. So it says connected now. And um, yeah, let's go back to the app. And then print. Now you see it's sending the image to my little mobile printer and then it will print out the sheet. It might take a few seconds. Don't forget these images are pretty big. They are about two or three megabytes because the phones are, have 
such good quality images meanwhile so it might take a bit and then one is once it's sent first the blue sheet will come out that's a scan actually and then after that um the picture will come out so let's give it a few seconds it really doesn't take long it maybe takes a minute so that's how we go on you can hear it already and now you will see the blue sheet coming out and you see it also pushes out another sheet of paper with don't really worry about that, we put that back in uh, a little later. So next up now is the picture. you see it's already printed how cool is that isn't that easy um, you see it's printed all the four pictures are on it and the next thing we do is using the skitter so let's cut that so let me cut just those two quickly you can make a photo each day for what this day stood for what nice thing happened to you whatever you plan to that's just fine and uh, yeah today we got uh, the door painted so I would put that here and that one here or you can put that here under the boxes so you have more space here to write it whatever suits you but the main point is see they fit perfectly into the boxes yeah that's it from simplelifestories.net don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel or come over to simplelifestories.net and subscribe to our newsletter looking forward to see you in the next video bye